Our condolences goes to Marcy Moyo's family and we commend her for her patriotism for the country now. Moving on, there's a new marathoner in town. Kenya's first lady, Margaret Kenyatta, who started light training in November last year, is not just training for the coming half marathon charity race, but has been hooked up in draw dresses. The first lady displayed her growing prowess at Kusarani Stadium this morning during one of our opening training sessions. The first lady is getting ready for the inaugural first lady half marathon set for March 9th in Nairobi. Lin Washira reports. Morning is when the week is lit, a flame ignited and the day delighted with heat and light and Kenya's first lady Margaret Kenyatta seems to know this only too well. She embraced athletics little last year when the need to raise funds for mothers and children came to being under her Beyond Zero campaign. As the inaugural first ladies half marathon edge closer, Mrs. Kenyatta has gone top gear and she was on Thursday morning joined by a group of athletics lovers for an intensive training session at the Safaricom Stadium Kasarani home of heroes. She has successfully moved beyond zero kilometers and has already run three 10 kilometer races in a couple of weeks under the stewardship of former world marathon champion Douglas Wakihuri. Because you get injuries, you heal, you pick yourself up again and continue. Yeah, it's been up and down. It's becoming her lifestyle now because she's been doing it for the last, uh, since, this, since November last year. And uh, I don't think it's going to stop soon. She will be spearheading the First Ladies Half Marathon on 9th of next month, during which renowned marathoners like Tekla Lorupe will also take part in. The First Lady will also be heading to the London Marathon in April. I definitely hope to finish and I hope to be there to congratulate the Kenyan team for winning. It's nothing so easy, but you have to train and work hard as our First Lady said, and it has come from your heart. It's a grueling training regime that kicked off on November of last year and the first lady of this country doesn't look like she's just about to slow down or just about to stop. The training keeps going on and on with the final journey being the London Marathon on 13th of April. Lynn Washira, KTN.